NFL teams will take a swing at a developmental prospect all the time. The question with these guys become how much can you fix with coaching? Javon Dexter has the upside to be a game wrecker. The question is, can he get there? Find out in this 2 minute drill. Dexter's raw physical tools make him an enticing defensive line prospect, as his combine results compare to star NFL linemen such as Jonathan Allen and Gerald McCoy. At 6'6 and 310 pounds, he has the size to play the nose tackle position while also possessing the athletic upside to be an impact pass rusher. His 40-yard dash time of 488 was in the 98th percentile for a defensive tackle, showing his high-end quickness at his size. Dexter has shown flashes of being a fearsome pass rusher. At times, he uses his length, quickness, and size effectively to make plays in the pass and run game. Dexter has shown great durability during his time at Florida, appearing in every game during his time there, and often playing high snap counts. Despite his impressive physical skill set, Dexter's play at Florida has been rather underwhelming. In 36 college starts, he recorded just 5 sacks and 10.5 tackles for loss. Dexter's lack of consistent impact shows up on the tape. He possesses a poor anchor and is constantly blown off the line of scrimmage by more powerful offensive linemen. His underwhelming strength makes him a target in the run game for double teams and he does not have the technical ability to make plays and hold his ground. Dexter's motor is unimpressive in the pass game and there are concerning plays on tape where he jogs out of play. Dexter's not much of a pass rusher technically either. He does not have any reliable pass rush moves. While he is naturally an excellent athlete, he often does not show it during the games. His first step is slow, and he does little to challenge linemen with his explosiveness. My pro comparison for Dexter is former Nebraska defensive tackle Malik Collins. Collins was another impressive athlete at the position, whose production was underwhelming and often did not use his explosiveness and strength effectively on the field. In order to earn a role in the NFL, Collins had to improve and refine his game, especially as a pass rusher. Dexter has all the tools to become an impact NFL player, but he must learn how to unlock his natural abilities and become a more consistent player on the field. Due to his upside, I can see a team selecting Dexter on day two of the draft, but it might be a while before he becomes a difference maker that he's capable of being. And that's the two minute drill.